Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Crusader Kings 2. Yes, we won our crusade in the sense that the guy converted didn't get all of his land, which is a bit unfortunate, but... Yeah. Well, it's done again, some reorganization, too. I, I, I mean, I was pretty high on uh, uh, Vassal Limit, so... Hmm. Probably okay. Probably for the best, yeah. yeah. Anyway, let's go ahead and uh, unpause it. Let uh, time continue. Yes. Oh my god, so many pop-ups. Yeah, we did some uh, some plot cancelling. How many did you uh, have? For... I had 133. That's a few plots. 133 plots, yes. Hmm. Let's see, your guards have captured someone in the tunnels. However, the person does not seem to be completely stable. Your guards' faces are not showing the usual bloodthirst as they present Eudocia, the Troubadour, a starved-looking and oddly jumpy person. It would almost be a mercy to execute her, you say? <laughs> well, if you're gonna give the button, Ord is gonna click it. <laughs> well, no, it's more that I've seen this event before. I don't trust it. Yeah, she... I... Do not trust it. She often all. ends up being a stabby woman, doesn't she? Yeah. Uh, I do have Gavelkin succession in Italy, which is uh, a little bit powerful right now, but we'll be okay, I think. All right, Pope. How many troops do you have? Four K, you say? Four mm. K. Is your claim on Roma? Oh look! Oh dear! What, what, whatever is going to happen now? Oh, <laughs> oh! It looks like we're going to have to uh, slaughter, slaughter you, Pope. I'm just going to raise up my personal troops. I gave out uh, Sardinia, so I now just have the uh, the Duchy of uh, Tuscany. Makes sense. Composing a book on a break from your work. From working on my book, I have been sitting for hours in the courtyard, watching the knights ride at the Quintain. I am certain that I am about to grasp some kind of insight from the repeated motions, yet my head is only filled with the pounding of horse hooves. Suddenly, the flicker of torches makes me realize night has fallen. I could do this all night. Maybe I should. 80% chance that I develop a cold of some sort. While I have camp fever. Well, I mean, there's a sensible decision, and then there's the risky decision. <laughs> it's fine. What's the worst that could happen? De Dehabilitating and terrible death? Like I said, what's the worst that could happen? <laughs> oh, oh, the Pope died. Well, I mean, he, did have, he did have war declared on him. Uh, he was shocked, apparently. Mm. Um... He wants. He, he he went to uh, the crusade with me. He he wants Rome now. What? What is this? I have a fever. Dropped it. Farewell. Don't screw this up. I'm glad I hired you. I can I negotiate with this burger person, who's wearing a. <laughs> what? This particular host looks like a Catholic priest, but is actually a Germanic pagan. <laughs> where where is he? Uh, it's Burger's Host, up uh, in the northwest of my land. Love huh. troops. Huh. <laughs> I wonder if that's because he was, uh, he looked like that in someone else's, uh, um... Cool, yeah. Or, or he just stole the hat and ran. <laughs> <laughs> that would be, that would be pretty amusing, if you could do that. Oh, I got diarrhea now. Oh, 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 wait, wait. You asked what the worst thing could happen. I've lost camp fever. No. I feel better. So so now I just have, in addition to all that, fever, headache, diarrhea, you know. All in a day's work. Where, where's my Pepto-Bismol, damn it? Glad I hired him. Absolutely Produced not. Produced truly revolutionary that. paper on the planets. Oh, truly revolutionary, nice. Oh, 
Okay, the Pope has decided to siege down my, uh, my capital, uh, so I'm gonna have to get in there and crush him. Uh, I have the flu, okay, that's fine. As long as you know what you're doing. It looks like the, uh, I feel as better. I expected, the English mayor here tipped the balance in favor. There is now an Urbino peasant revolt. English mayor, you say? Well, uh, that one county oh. that was elective. Right. Uh, she built a city, <laughs> and that city then elected the English horse, <laughs> Earl David the Just. <laughs> he takes after his mother. He does. <laughs> He's still alive. The 51 year old. Had a, uh, a second. Uh, um, yeah, I see. Uh, Crimea there is now English. Hmm. He's done a good job, so I've, I've made him king of that area. Oh, that sounds good. Oh, what are you doing? She doesn't look very happy to have destroyed the Duchy of Bourbon. Oh, she destroyed it. I thought it said that she uh, usurped it. No, no, she blew it up. Okay, that's all under uh, uh, Burgundy right now, so. Stuff's a mess in my realm, really. I get way too many pop-ups now. Yes, there are many. I, uh... I rapidly dismiss them. Keep the show on the road. <laughs> Come I on, try to. Open up. It is. It's not always easy. Hey, when, I can um, rank up. <clears throat> when I had that one episode that I lost, and I had to force everyone who watches my side to watch yours instead. Uh huh. My best friend was like, "You move so fast compared to him." Because <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, I'm gonna pop up and I'll close it in two seconds. <laughs> yeah, I always want to look at it. Mind you, did bite me in the butt once, so... It's not the best approach, I guess. In single player, you can take things at your leisure. Yeah. Hello, Catherine. We shall make you do etiquette. Alright, let's siege down Rome. Actually, Tusculum is the, uh, the capital for him, not... Uh... <laughs> he, he does not control the Bishopric of Rome. <laughs> That's pretty fantastic. Someone has learnt the trait way of the dragon. Nice. Hmm. Got a pretty decent chunk of cash. Oh, hey, the Pope's taking care of the uh, Urbino Peasant Revolt. Good on him. Yes. While I am currently sieging down Rome. Joan might fancy me. No, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna hunt my son's wife. It's, it's not appropriate. Ah, <laughs> oh, make a move. No. Uh, We've already got enough danger of inbreeding with how close our two dynasties are. So. <laughs> oh, was that was that one of my uh... one of your commenters yet? Yeah. Are they all looking a little uh, bit Greek at the moment, actually? Yes, yes I am. Um, Alright, uh, let's see. Ah, oh, stupid commanders. Um, stop, stop quitting or dying or whatever it is that you do. Oh, crap. I keep... Oh, I know what to do. Um, you're not allowed to uh, lead troops. There we go. That'll, that'll, that'll fix that. Kazari, right? There we go. I do have some spare cash, so I could go for another little little war. Bit of a flutter. Alright, Pope. No. Thank you. Alright, several tavern owners in Luca have come forward to your court with complaints against Duke Timotheos the Quarreler uh, of Abkhazia and Alania. Uh, 
apparently he has gone on drunken rampages in all of their establishments, and they are demanding compensation. Duke Timotheos claims to have no memory of the knights in question. Of course he's got no memory. <laughs> uh, I'll pay. Okay. I will hold on to uh, Rome for now, because... Uh, You're well, sort of rubbing in his face, don't you? <sighs> this guy's gonna... Oh, this guy actually loves me, so yeah, I, I guess I will hold on to it for a while. <laughs> has, How did this happen? He's excommunicated me. <laughs> I can't imagine why he would excommunicate me. Yeah. Oh, I can open the gates. Let's go ahead and do that. Alright, because like I... The grand tournament. Do that. I'll go ahead and build a war chest. Uh... Pope is defending against uh, Lido Papal War for the city of Tresogallo, and against Duchess Elena the Chaste in Anconian Papal Border Dispute over Ravenna. I just got a claim on Chios. I don't suppose you have a lot of money right now. Me? Yeah. I do have 4,000 gold. Uh... You want how to? Much would it, yeah, how much would a gift be? Gifts about 500, I believe. Uh, 900 of them. Okay, yeah, do you mind uh, I mean, shoving some of that down my throat? Sure. It's Thank not Mandrake, but it'll do. Yeah, makes me feel better, that's for sure. Uh, so that means that I have a claim on Chios, but I think I've lost. I think I had a claim on Ephesos, and I've lost it. Yeah. All right, let's move you over there. There we go. Oh, so let's, uh, right. let's not leave armies. Yeah, probably a bad idea. This is the time. More treasures. People are getting injured. So many people are getting injured. Never get taught him an eye. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that, that, that'll do it. I think it's just nature's way of pr pruning the ranks. <laughs> Bunch of people dying as well. Yeah. You're like, I have too many vassals. Let's kill half of them. Host no one of importance. Yeah, no one of importance uh, had anything happen to them, unfortunately. So Ancona decided to uh, um, do a border dispute war. How much are so? Why are you in my prison? Oh, you! Anselm, that's my um, name. How about the Ublia? I don't care what happens. Thank you. Well, I'll just, I'll just move into you. I've got double the troops. No. Okay, King Vimento learns the trait Way of the Leopard. Ah, uh, yes, which is Way of the Bomb. <laughs> <laughs> oh, but then he died. That is unfortunate. And your son is busy Gothic, which is not good. At least your next son is actually English. I could do a de jure claim on uh, Slavonia. Let's uh, plot to kill you. Might not be a bad idea. A Catholic uprising. Uh, in a weird sense, I'm actually going to take out the Catholic uprising because I don't want it to succeed. <laughs> Catholic uprising where? Right next door to me in Kiev. It's like, well, I would actually appreciate having this land, so I will take out the Catholic <laughs> Uprising. The book composed. Everyone knows that I have spent several years directing the work on my book, when today I am presented with the final product. Excellent, I commend my scribes. While I gently leaf through lessons taught me by my enemy. By Emperor Alessandro. Hmm. Yes, perhaps I should have dedicated it to the demons in my head. Gain 100 prestige... 
Um, <laughs> the description's pretty some... good. <laughs> oh, my rival. Uh, my rival's opinion improves by 10 for 20 years. Strangely flattered. <laughs> well, read the description. You might see why. I need to, uh, need to find it in my list. Hmm. There we go. Uh, this tome describes the famed rivalry between Emperor Alessandro and Katarina, and there are several lessons on personal combat to be gained, gleaned from its pages. The surprising thing is how many of their dark... their... Duels? Oh, duels. Yeah. Seem to have taken place in uh, various bedchambers. Mm. Apparently it's a little bit too long for the uh, um, the big text. The box, yes. <laughs> yeah. Uh, personal combat skill plus one, intrigue plus one, martial plus one. Not too mm. shabby. Not too shabby. Alright. It does feel a bit gamey, the fact that I can just attack Catholic rebels and it's fine. <laughs> oh, they've reinforced. I'm working on the... Uh... Alright, my plot. What are you doing? City of Tres... Ah, okay. Someone from, uh... One of the houses in, uh, Rome... Uh, Venice is attacking, uh, the Pope. Oh, come on. <laughs> I, I made the mistake of clicking auto-invite plotters. <laughs> Oh, my uh, acquaintance, King Alexander of Wallachia, died under suspicious circumstances. Was that you? Yes, it was. Um, success! King Alexander was caught in a deadly arrow crossfire between the scroll depository and a grassy knoll. The story, was, ah. the story we conducted about a lone bowman seems to be working perfectly. <laughs> ah, I don't believe it. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, do I want to... Uh, uh, Learn of the operations of the sun, the stars, the gods, or uh, secrets hidden throughout the world. I think I'll go for the stars. And I will go ahead and build an office of alchemy. Because I do not have one. Cool, that's that fixed. I didn't More want science. to have a busy gothic guy undoing yeah. all the hard work. Understandable. Oh, God damn it! there's more illness. Stupid slow fever. Get out of here. Wait, there's more. I can't afford to build stuff right now. I'm trying to boost up my stuff. Alright. I win I win wars. That was that was more a statement of fact rather than a statement of fact, yep. but you know. <laughs> Alright, closing the uh closing the gates again. You're possessed, Steal I'm not it. making you. Why does Italy get sick so often? In bad sanitation? Uh, the hospital and friends has seen an increase in the amount of people looking for food and shelter lately. Oh, that's gonna be a lot of money. Holy war for Kiev. Uh, I can't afford that right now. Let's send in the Knights Hospital. I have apparently gained the depressed trait. Well, one thing the hermetics tell us is that if you're ever depressed, the solution is to take drugs. I unfortunately do not uh, have two ingredients. Oh. So I'm going to have to wait a little bit. Since I can't go out and get them now. I've only got one I can ingredient still myself. build my laboratory, though. Well, you can build your laboratory while inside. Let's build a fort. Alright, Pope, you need to die. Speaking of, I was actually going to do some building of, um... Wow, this guy has all the negative modifiers. 
was doing some <laughs> building of market villages and earth hill forts to help out these tribal vassals because they've got no income. Um, I would also recommend uh, if you have a whole crap ton of prestige, um, any any building that's at uh, level one or level three, build that. Oh yeah, I just um. Like these are these are the tribes that spawn when you take no nomadic territory, so they've got nothing. Gotcha, gotcha. That's fair. Well, have you ever noticed that? Because sometimes they'll they'll build them themselves. Yeah. All right. Well, it is about time to end the episode. Wow. What fair the enough. heck is going China's on? Still with, in uh, unrest. <laughs> the great company is uh, at war with the mercenary invasion of Bavaria. At ninety-five mm. percent, we awesome. may see another uh, um, uh, mercenary company hold territory. That would be pretty awesome. Yeah, I um, one of my little mods I was making just for fun was like allowing them to do it much more easily. And it's cool to see it happen in the base game. <laughs> All right, well, uh, for now, we'll uh, call this an episode. When we come back next time, uh, maybe the Pope will die and I can attack him again. <laughs> Already maybe. excommunicated. Who cares? Fair enough. See you next time, everyone. Take care.